A young Chicago boy from Chatham is alive tonight in part because of a quick thinking neighbor. But he's no ordinary guy. The neighbor is a former Olympian and world champion boxer. CBS 2's Vince Gerasoli introduces us to the man with powerful hands. Well, first of all, how you feeling? I feel a little sore. Donnell Doc Nicholson's traveled the world as a pro boxer. I feel like I had a fight with a beast. He's gone rounds with the best. Every time he reached, I count on reach. And even competed on the U.S. 1992 Olympic team. He had my hand in his mouth. But his latest challenger was no contender. It was a 70 pound pit bull that police say came running out of this quiet south side home and into a crowd of children. I looked at my left, the little kid was on the ground. For some reason, the dog focused on eight year old Demarcus Feltus. He jumped on me and started chewing through my leg. Understandably, Demarcus and friends began screaming. I was frightened and that water will help. Fortunately, Nicholson at his nearby car grabbed a golf club and tried to beat the dog away. Boom, it broke. The golf club broke. Broke in hell. Oh. Nicholson sustained bites to his legs, stomach, and hands and remembers the life saving encounter blow by like blow. He jumped at me again. Oh, I, boom, I hit him. Jumped again. Bam. I got him here. On my, I'm on one knee. Choking him. But Ruth Baltimore, the little boy's grandmother, is glad Doc was stronger. I know it could have been much worse had he not been there because he sustained a lot of injuries trying to save my grandson. I'm not a hero. I'm doing what. I think any man should have done and, and stepped up and to the plate on an injured young kid. I'd do it anytime. 